Hey guys, welcome back to Design Engineer Studio. Today we'll be learning how to use the grid tool. All right, let's. This is the grid tool. This is it. This line, this straight line. They are grid. This, these things are grid. So we want to learn today how to use them. Once you click on the tool, click on it. There's two things you see down here. This is a magnet and this is the grid set. So this is the magnet. Anything you let us want to something like shape. This is a shape. Let's shape the color. And you are using the magnet to remember you want the magnet to. So it is yeah, once the point this point you are dragging once it touches the grid lines it's going to show you a red it's going to display something reddish telling you that you've reached the the that the you've reached the line and that's to that let's go to the grid setting you come here what and the one here is is used for adding is this for adding lines or vertically you can see let's assume from this and this and this you want to add lines you click on this and you press here it's going to add a line at the center of the two i hope you guys understand and if it is this this you want to add lines horizontally so you you click on it between this and this so you click on this and it's going to add it down and if you want to remove if you want to remove lines you will you click on this one once you click on it it is removed once you click on this and you click on this it is removed and if you want to know the distance apart this from this you can come here this is 50 the position is 50 and this one is 24 meaning that it is 20 20 if i'm not mistaken 26 apart so let's say you click on 25 so it is equal this way they are equal this way and if you want to add more grids like i don't want only this this tdt vertical and horizontal you can come here and add more lines this let's say you want to add 20 you click on next then you click on 20 again so you click on ok so anything you want to do when we are working on a design and you want to when you want to start editing make sure you have this make sure you have it the reason why you are going to have it is that once you click on the screen it's going to be adjusted so it has distorts the whole grid lines so let's do it again we are adding 20 right so we are adding 20 so you have this and you can click on the magnet to here click on it and it's going to tell you you reach that point when you shrink it i mean you you adjust the shape it's going to tell you you've reached this certain point we use grid also for alignment we also use grid for alignment let's let me take one of my designs let me show you one of my designs Let's off the grid to here and let's kill it up. This so. let's lock it. So if you want to use the grid to let's reset this. We 
can use the grid tool to align this is it you just click on this and you just drag it here so automatically you see that this this text are aligned to the left as you can see very well here now they align to the left and if there are a lot of things you want to align as well you can align vertically and horizontally we'll be explaining more about it when we want to when we are doing another project so we'll be explaining more about it so you'll be able to understand it very well but i just want to introduce the, the grid tool for you so that it won't, you won't be new to it when we are designing in our next video so if you guys get value in this video don't forget to click on the subscribe button smash the notification bell and thanks for watching and if you have any question drop it in the comment box thanks